Okay. Okay, ready? Eason, stay here. Sun, you have to come back. You have to come back. You have to stay over here if you want to go see the toys. Oh, hold on. Hello. Hey guys, hey, if you are checking us out on the replay, hey Dan, hey mom. Hey Deb Stapley, hey where are you guys joining from? Hey Annie, hey Mom Lark, hey Rachel. Um, I'm, I get, got some really good advice the other day um, from my sister who said, hey, get to the point on your periscope. So I'm gonna try really hard to stay concise and get to the point and not get distracted because I have so much fun seeing where all of you guys are joining from and I get all like, distracted and I want to talk to you and I want to answer big questions and I want to ask all of you big questions so um, I will just get right to it so we are here at Target right now and hold on a second I am having so much fun sharing these periscopes with you and so here we are hello oh my gosh Fern my sister was here just a couple hours ago so um here we go. If you don't, and I have, let's see, I have two of my five children with me. If you um, are a mom and you've ever wondered what about all this baby food, you have so much to choose from down this baby food aisle. And I remember wondering when I only had one kid, um, what baby food do I even need? Why is there so much to choose from? How complicated can this be? Um, hey, soccer mom. Hey, oh wow, hi from China. That's so awesome. Thanks for letting me know where you're coming from, you guys. Um, I love this. So I just wanted to share with you today um, a few things on this aisle that I love and a few things that I hate on this aisle as far as baby food goes. So if you know anyone, six babies, wow. I'm one of six too. I'm the oldest of six. Um, I love big families. So if you know anyone who's expecting or might wanna know um, about tips like this from somebody like me, someone who has five kids, or um, you can share this broadcast by swiping to the side if you're on an iPhone or down um, if you're on an Android. So I'm here at Target because this is close to my home and I love Target. It is like the second most happiest place on earth next to Disneyland, which is also near me, which is like really exciting so I'm gonna flip the camera around and show you a little a few things what I think um, you need from this aisle okay so here we go really quick okay so you have at the top you have these so I love these these are called baby mum mum cookies and they're rice crackers and they are not messy they don't make a big um, soggy mess all over the baby's face and they this baby is eating one right now. <laughs> and I gave her one so that she would let us periscope without whining and crying at us. I love these squeeze pouch foods. And you can look for these when they go on sale and just stock up on them. Um, some companies call them grabbers, some companies just call them on the go, whatever. And that was a new invention at like baby number three for me and I was like yes that's amazing those come with a little spoon that you can um, twist on top of it and just squeeze it but don't get the spoon thing that I want you to know you don't need the spoon attachment it just gets messy and dirty and there's there's no one um, there's there's just no reason that you need to have the spoon you could just bring a spoon yourself um, so back around Yep. Mom, do we have this and this? Yeah, we do. Okay, so I'm going to flip you back around. So, obviously, puffs are amazing. Um, these cookies are good, but they get really messy. Avoid these. Anything that says cookies that are like a shortbread or anything like that is going to make a big, terrible, soggy mess. Hello, we are on Periscope Live on the internet. I'm so sorry. Hold on, we have to make way for this nice lady. You bet. Goodbye. See, look, mom, see, we have issues. Mommy, we gotta get it done. Mommy, mom, um, yeah. do you have this? No, okay. Mommy, Another thing to mommy, avoid. We, we, we do have this. Yeah, we do. Another thing to avoid, I think that this stuff is such a waste of money. 
You do not need to buy this stuff. These, um, and these like third foods, I think this is a waste of money. These things with little bits in them, like you just, you can cut up little bits of food of whatever you're eating that day at your own house. And by the way, this is just, it's not that fresh. It's, once they're starting to eat table food, just give them real table food. You don't have to buy table foods in here. Now, you have first foods, second foods, and then like we just showed you the third food. food. So, these first foods come in a smaller package, and for like 12 cents more, you can get way more food, and it's seriously, there's no difference that I'm aware of or that I've been able to tell between the first and the second foods. So spend an extra 12 cents and just always go for the second foods. By the time they're ready to eat third foods down there, just get them food from your house and cut it up. So don't waste your money on that. Um, <clears throat> here's some more of these cookies, and they seem like a good idea at the time, but I'm telling you, they will make such a big mess. So avoid the cookies. I love the freeze-dried fruits and ve veggies and the freeze-dried yogurt drops. Um, and let's see, I think that's... So that's it for me today. Um, avoid the cookies, avoid the third foods. That's totally a waste of money. Um, and go for the second level. Don't waste your money on the first foods because that's... It's just giving you less food for like more money. Um, and those little spoon things that attach to these pouches don't get the spoons. It just makes a big, huge mess. Okay, so I hope that you guys like this. Hello, another mom's coming through. I know this mom. <laughs> from She's another friend from school. Um, so I'm going to move out of the way. But if you know anybody who um, would want to know more about this, I will write a post on it on my blog, which you can follow at um, ocbeautymom.com. Or you can find me on Instagram at ocbeautymom. Okay? Um, and see. Bye, look. I can't get her to stay seated. <laughs> Bye, son. Bye, you guys. Bye.